What's up, YouTube? In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to record your mixes using the program DJ Intro. So the two programs you're going to need today is Audacity, which you could download from your site. It's free. And you're going to need DJ Intro and uh, whatever controller that's con uh, compatible with DJ Intro. All right. Another thing that you're going to need is you're going to need a RCA cord that's going to plug in to your laptop where you usually plug in your headphones. So the end is going to look like this, basically. So plug that into your laptop. Now you're going to want to have DJ Intro open. And you're also going to want to have Audacity open. I'm using a Mac, so I want to go to my settings. Because usually the laptop is going to bring the sound out, usually going into your headphones. But now we want the sound to come in from our controller into our laptop and recording into audacity so basically i'm going to open my system preferences then i'm going to go to sound and now it says use audio port 4 and i'm going to change it to sound input because the sound is going to go into my laptop and into the program audacity so once i change uh use audio port for sound input i'm going to exit out i'm going to open up audacity And basically, you're just going to want to have a new file or whatever. And uh, when you're ready to start recording your mix, you're going to want to press record. Once I press record, you want to start your mix. So basically, once I press the red button, I'm going to open up um, my Ser Serato DJ intro and I'm going to press the play button. All right. And it's fine if you don't start the mix right away because after you're finished mixing, recording your whole mix, you can always go back into this program and delete the area where you didn't start on your mix. All right, so I'm going to click the record button. And you see it's recording, but I'm not playing any music yet. So I'm going to go into Serato DJ intro, and I'm going to click the play button. Alright, so right now, the sound is going out into my speakers, but it's also going into the program of Audacity. And this is all because it's going in. Alright, so once you finish recording, you're just going to um, press the stop button or you're going to press the record button again to stop. Now I could go back and I could listen to my mix by pressing the play button. Alright, thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any questions or comments, just please uh, leave them in the uh, comments below. Alright, thanks.